Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Today I am gonna show how to create Xamarin levels. In my last video, I have shown how to configure Visual Studio for Xamarin and how to create a new Xamarin application. Let's create a new application. Today, I will create an application using blank template. Let's create. Okay, it's done. You will find here app.xml file and main page.xml file. When you will run this application, thus this main page will be run first. I'm gonna create a new page for more discussion about labels. Add new item content page and name the page is labels. Okay, it's done. You will find here a label. If I run this application, this label will be displayed. app.xml.cs class here this is the startup page if we run this application the main page will be displayed I'll change this startup page as level okay this is an level this is level I'll create another level text level two font size large. We will find here different type of font size. I'll select large I'll create another level change the text color dark blue and we can also set line height this is level 4 Create another level. Horizontal option center. We can set line break mode. Line break mode will find word wrap no wrap what drip I'm repeating this line and no wrap okay it's good Okay, that's good. Let's run this application and see what happened. Okay, it's running. The number of label one, here is the normal label, the number of two is the large font size large, and the number of label three is text color dark blue number level 4 line height 15 number of level 5 is the horizontal option center and you will find the text in horizontally center 
and the number of six num level you use word wrap and number of seven level there is no wrap let's create another level and change some properties change Let's run this application and see what happened. Okay, we find here the level, it's blue color italic, and with underline, and text size is 24. So let's create another level. Here I will use formatted text If we want to change level text in different style a single level we can use formatted text here I will create different type of span and change the style Okay, in this way we can change a label text in different format. So let's run this application and see what happened. Okay, that's good. We will find here a label in different color and style. In that way we can use formatted string. Let's create another label. In this label, I will show gesture recognizer. If we tap this label, it will fire a command and read it into a URL. So let's see how can we do that. We will use a command, a binding tap command. We have to initialize a command, public i command. For redirect you into a URL, we have to use we have to use launcher dot open a sync and we we have to pass a string URL Okay, now press this click here. Just press click here and it will redirect into it, this URL. First time you have to accept. Oh, that's good. It's redirected to this URL.
we can also pass common parameter we will pass this url string from this parameter and you have to use string and the parameter string url and use this url here okay done let's run okay that's good it's working so yeah this is the process that we can use label in my next video i'm gonna show how to use text boxes or entries thanks for watching my videos and if you are new in my channel please subscribe my channel thank you